on the tape hold back and be open. Welcome back to Bumpy Road. Today I have from Three Floyds Brewing out of Munster, Indiana, Zombie Dust. This comes in at 6.2% ABV and 50 IBUs, and this is a courtesy of One Cast One Fish. So thank you very much, One Cast One Fish. And once again, I will post a link to his channel at the end of the uh, video. And also, I have a, uh, a friend of mine with me. This is Alan. Thank so you. he has not had a zombie dust. I have not. So we, we are going to uh, experience this first time together. Well, it's got a good aroma coming off of it already, so. I'll give myself the, you got a, a, a bit more head, <laughs> yeah. So, the wheat pour, not really a head, but it does have some white tight bubbles um, on the heavier pour. As you can see, it kind of uh, shows up a bit more. more. Yes. Color on this, how's yours looking? Yours is looking clearer. Yep, mine's looking a lot clearer than yours. Mine's looking hazy, so I don't know if there's any um, sediment at the bottom, but mine, I can't see through it. Definitely might have been a little sediment because this is very clear. Yeah. So we're probably going to experience a couple different flavors. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the aroma on it. Picking up almost like a tea to a like a citrus type tea. Yeah, it's, it's kind of it's like the bright summery yeah. type. So it does smell smell kind of uh, a little bit sweet. Definitely get the citrus notes. Yeah. I'm gonna go in for the first swig. You ready? <laughs> So it's got a it's got like a light body feel to it. Carbonation is uh, it's medium carbonation. It's pretty much a, a, the same flavor as the aroma. I was gonna say like to me like I was expecting a different flavor based on the aroma. Like it's a lighter flavor than the aroma. It's not. I pick up. I do pick up some of the malt. You get you get the malt in the in the taste, yep. but not in the aroma. It's not as citrus forward in the, the taste. It feels. And we'll try to find a bottle date on this because things do change over time. Plus, this was shipped. So you're you're looking at it going through temperature changes and everything. Yeah, so I get a little bit of a, a little like a it's almost on the cracker to almost like a wheat type flavor, I think, from the malt. Yeah. And then uh a bit of a, a citrus hint coming at the tail end, but yeah, I think it is, you're right, and more citrus ar aromatic definitely has kind of like the the taste to like one of the summery wheat wheat beers yeah it's not not bad no um, I, i'm thinking i actually like it i'm thinking i'm thinking like super fresh i think it's going to be a totally yeah. different, different outcome. I'm probably gonna have to try to do um, 
one of the uh, clone recipes I've seen because this thing's like all over the place as, as far as like homebrewing clone recipes. This thing's like huge. Yeah. Everybody wants it. So uh, I know that they use like, I think 100% citra hops. So yeah. Uh, so once again, thank you one cast, one fish for this opportunity to uh, get the um, three Floyds uh, series that you, that you sent out and appreciate the zombie dust. I'm gonna uh, try to try to brew this up um, at some point too. So definitely yeah. look forward to that. And I appreciate my friend Alan joining me. Appreciate you for having me over for this. <laughs> this was this was a great time. We we never even did a cheers to begin. We with. didn't. How we, we can do it now. Cheers. <laughs> cheers. Cheers, everybody. Thanks for cheers. watching.